Hammer tutorial on the Hour Man and a superhero that can turn back time one hour. And how appropriate that we're dealing with Iron, uh, Hour Man because we're going to deal with verbs, especially the imperfect and the future, because those will occur most definitely on the National Greek exam beginning. So first off, we have to remember subject verb agreement. First person singular only goes with first person verbs. Ego, second person singular only goes with second person singular verb forms. Su. Hemes, plural nominative only goes with first plural. Humes only goes with second plural. All right, so subject verb agreement. A neuter noun, however, can be taking the verbs uh, in the singular. It can take the verb in the singular. When two or more subjects are connected by and, the verb is in the plural. If the subjects are different persons, the verb is in the first person, if that's what's there. Plural. All right. So, therefore, uh, two guys would take the plural. Uh, the Both I and thou would be I and we, or, you, or I and you, or we. And then, of course, you... And other people is you, plural. Let's talk about the present indicative. Now, present indicative active, all verbs that we've known so far are present. Grap, fo, right? Uh, you could also have imperfect. Imperfect have separate endings and an epsilon augmentation or lengthening of the first vowel, such as ante, it is in bloom, goes to ante. Um, for the imperfect, epathon, right? Patho to epathon. Uh, future is a sigma added. So grapho goes to grapso, uh, basiluso, right? So therefore, you have to worry about the present. The imperfect found with an epsilon augmentation or a lengthening of the initial vowel and their separate endings. Or the future, which is simply a sigma added to the present stem. So therefore, these are the same verbs we learned in chapter two: luo, luais, luwe, luoma, lueto, luzen. You do need to know the middle and their usages. Middle passive: luo, my, I loose for myself, or I am loosed. Luwe, luetai, luamatha, luesta, luontai. Notice the alpha and the epsilon here. The uh, will ask you if it's an alpha contract or an epsilon contract. They will have different connecting vowels. So hoi duloi, right? Plural, third plural. Usen, nice. I am loosening for singular. Honeyaniasto athlon. We are dealing with the third singular ferritai. All right, let's talk about the imperfect. The imperfect, as I said before, has an epsilon augmentation. It's an epsilon at the beginning or a lengthening of the vowel. And, of course, you have the irregular ain, right, for sum, or Amy, A or Ain, Asta, Ain, Amen, Eta, Asa. So that's a totally different form, it seems like, because it's mostly middle. So let's look at the endings. On, S, N, Omen, Eta, On. Boy, those look very easy. Uh, alpha contract, the alpha stays there, so it becomes length, it becomes added to the uh, this normal ending. On, As, A, Omen, Ata, On. Un, ace, a, umen, ete, un, just epsilon contract. Middle, same idea. But instead of my, it's a separate form, main, right? So, elu, epsilon contract, elu, main, elu, elueto, eluometha, elustha, and elun, onto. Same for the alpha contract, epsilon, uh, the, uh, uh, Omicron goes to omega when it's with an alpha, right? Etimomain, etimoa, etimato, etimometha, etimasta, etimonto. Ephilumain, ephilu, ephileta, ephilumetha, ephilesta, ephilunto. So the imperfect will signify a progressive past. I was destroying, or an iterative, perhaps, I used to destroy. The middle, same idea. I was destroying myself. I used to destroy myself. I was being destroyed. I was used to be destroyed. So the imperfect is a very straightforward, imperfect past. She was fleeing herself. 
was, notice you have to have the epsilon augmentation. It's either this one or this one. But remember, you take the present stem. So this is the present stem. You just add the epsilon to it. That's an aorist. We don't have to worry about that till March. They used to lead. Remember, it's an alpha contract. Well, pardon me. It's, if the vowel begins with a, if the word begins with an alpha, it gets lengthened, an A. So a gal is the imperfect, right? So it'd be a gone. And then, of course, they were leaving, learning. And on, so there's your base form, manthan, right? So therefore, what do you have? Epsilon contract. There's your present stem. There's your ending. Man, man, thanon. Let's talk about the future. The future we've talked about already. Sigmas added to the stem. Uh, epsilon augmentate. If it's an alpha contract, it becomes lengthened. Epsilon contract becomes lengthened. You do need to know about the irregular future. S O M I S A S T I S S A M A T H A S S A S O N T I. Future is simply a simple future, actual, I will destroy, I will destroy myself. It only occurs in the middle. All right, so you will suffer for yourself. It's middle. So, therefore, we look for sigma. That's an epsilon. That's an epsilon. Those don't work. That's a pasco. Therefore, it's epise. We also have I will speak. Therefore, that's an epsilon. That's an epsilon. Those are wrong. To be a leg or a lexo, leg with sigma next to it becomes lex. They will send, so it's active. So therefore, pempusin is present, but you add a sigma to it, it's pempusin. That takes care of all of Iron Man. Good luck. It will encompass about 10% of the exam.